The BioLegend Clearing Enhanced 3D, or C3D Tissue Clearing Kit, allows for rapid and robust clearing of diverse tissues for applications like multicolor fluorescence microscopy. It works via this simple immersion of tissue into the clearing reagent and does not require special equipment. In this video, we will walk you through a general protocol starting from animal perfusion to tissue clearing to slide mounting. Begin by preparing fresh heparin PBS solution. Add 10 units of heparin per milliliter of PBS. Use at least 50 milliliters per mouse. Circulate the ice-cold heparin PBS by pump for at least 30 minutes to remove air bubbles before cardiac perfusion. Perform a transcardial perfusion wash in the chemical fume hood under anesthesia. Perfuse with at least 25 milliliters of chilled heparin PBS solution at a pump speed of 0.5 milliliters per minute. Follow up with a transcardial perfusion fixation using at least 25 milliliters of fresh 1 or 4% PFA solution at a pump speed of 0.5 milliliters per minute until mouse limbs and tail become hard. Keep the PFA solution covered with aluminum foil. Harvest the organ and place it inside a 50 milliliter conical tube. Keep the tube chilled. If necessary, trim the organ to the appropriate size or remove the connective tissue or fat residue while on ice. Wash the organ repeatedly with at least 25 milliliters of heparin PBS at four degrees Celsius until the solution is cleared of blood. Fix the organ with at least 25 milliliters of chilled one or 4% PFA at four degrees Celsius. Replace with fresh PFA if the solution becomes cloudy or pink to ensure complete removal of blood and efficient fixation. Let the organ fix for 24 hours in the dark with mild shaking. Wash the organ in chilled PBS at four degrees Celsius for one hour. Repeat for a total of three washes. The fixed organ will need to be embedded in 2% agarose. Prepare the agarose by adding solid agarose to PBS in a beaker and melting in the microwave. Heat and stir until the agarose is completely dissolved. Keep the solution on a 65 degrees Celsius hot plate to prevent agarose from solidifying. Pour the agarose into a plastic weigh boat. When the agarose cools to around 40 to 42 degrees Celsius, the organ can be transferred into it. Gently wipe off excess PBS and transfer the organ. Then, fill the container until the organ is completely immersed in agarose. Wait until the agarose has solidified before tissue sectioning. Prepare tissue sections using a vibratome. It is recommended to set a speed of 0.3 millimeters per second and an amplitude at one millimeter. Cut 500 micron sections at four degrees Celsius. Carefully transfer the tissue sections to a 24 well plate. Larger sections may require a six or 12 well plate instead. Tissue sections can be stored at 4 degrees Celsius in a buffer containing 0.05% sodium azide in PBS for up to two weeks. The tissue will now be permeabilized and blocked before staining with antibodies. To each well with tissue sections, add an appropriate volume of CE3D permeabilization blocking buffer. Incubate at room temperature with gentle shaking for two days. Prepare the antibody cocktail at the desired concentration by diluting in the C3D antibody diluent buffer. Discard the permeabilization blocking buffer from each well in the plate by pipetting out the solution or transferring the tissue section to a new well. Add an appropriate volume of antibody cocktail to each well with a tissue section. For this demonstration, we are adding antibodies directly to the diluent in the well.
Incubate at room temperature with gentle shaking for two days. After incubation, discard the antibody cocktail solution. Wash each well by adding an appropriate volume of C3D wash buffer. Incubate at room temperature with gentle shaking for eight hours. Discard the wash buffer and repeat this step two more times. To prepare for tissue clearing, completely remove the wash buffer from each well. Excess buffer can interfere with efficient clearing. Prepare the C3D tissue clearing solution by gently mixing before use. Add an appropriate volume of the clearing solution to each well with a tissue section. Incubate at room temperature with gentle shaking for 2 to 12 hours. Prepare the sample chamber for mounting tissue sections. Assemble the sample chamber by attaching a spacer onto a slide. Fill the space with C3D tissue clearing solution. Carefully transfer and place the tissue section in the solution. Cover with a cover slip and avoid any air bubbles. Use nail polish to seal the edges of the cover slip. Let the slides air dry for two hours. They can be stored in the dark for up to two weeks. These slides are now ready for imaging. For full protocol details and troubleshooting guides, visit our website.